Hey guys, this is Bamulka with another episode of Europe's Ice Forest, the Switzerland attacking the biz No, attacking the Ottomans. I'm trying to let my guys squeeze through. I don't think it will work. We will do our best. Austria is trying to do the same. Oh my god, they their fleets are gone. Nice! Holy shit. Okay, guys, everyone. I don't know where they went. Most likely hunting something else somewhere. But Austrian fleet is over here. So even if they are up there, they will have to go through them. Fan-freaking-tastic. Oh, even Byzantium can defeat the Ottomans. They attacked the... No, they attacked the Byzantium. Help him! Don't let him squish! Oh, yes! Austria moved in. Let's get through! The breakthrough happened! We can do it! Destroy the heathens! Defeat the Ottomans! Get shrecked! Pursue them. Pursue and destroy them. I'll keep, keep this guy in Ankara, because he will have nice vision around and he can protect the sieging... Um, mercenaries. Which will hopefully be able to get through. He can't run really far, and we already squished a, an army this size, so it may be entirely possible. You fucked up, Ottomans! Woohoo! Hell yeah. Oman will be peace, peace outable soon as well, which is great. Holy shit, they are fighting each other, so one of them isn't in the war. Baluchistan isn't in the war. Nice. One less guy to worry about. Okay, he's not going there then. He's going somewhere else. Okay, so. Mercs, there. There. And there. Spread out! I should have more though. Do I, have more? I should have ten. I should have five sieging armies. I don't know where they are. There are none there. I don't know where they are. Oh, I have built ten, so if. Yeah. I think I combined them over here. Which was a mistake! Spread out, boys! We will not let them defeat you, don't you worry. No break in between, yes. Hardcore, we have to do this. I think he actually went only to Aleppo. This is where he ended. He can't run any further away. The trial? Hey, this is an... Actually, a decent way to get some Republican tradition, so I will take it. It's not bad. It's not that bad. It's much better if you have something with a shorter term. Because then you can get one of these events and it will like get give you back half of what you've lost by re-electing the guy. It's not a bad event. It looks like a really bad event, but it's actually not that bad. Especially if you can keep the guy for a while. They were not squished, but he's running this way. So I think he may be running to Baghdad or something. Let's pursue as well. Our uh, manpower is holding strong! I think we can actually afford to do this as well. No, let's keep these 15 guys there and go to Bolu. You can't win, Ottomans! How dare you siege my vassal? How dare you! We want to get rid of Tunis though. Just a pain in the ass. Okay, that's two years away. In two years, you will, you will be south. And mental note, let's not grab the trade power before we can use it. Uh, how about not going there? How about no? Stop! There we go. Now he's dead. Aye! There we go, so... 
the the last thing he has is this. So let's get access from Syria. Let's destroy this this pitiful puny little army. And good news, everyone. Coldest period of the Little Ice Age in Norway. Oh, poor guys, I forgot to uh, start the timer. Oh, heavens, this one will be slightly longer. I'm so sorry. Hmm, he's already like going somewhere. He's going places. This one isn't, so let's go squish that. So, and let's go squish this as well. Die! Be better with the leader, but. Whatever. Our manpower is actually going up. We don't even have the quantity ideas yet. He's going on the boat. Okay. <laughs> well, you will stay here and protect these little guys. Actually, do they make more sense in Konya? Maybe. Nah, this is better. Destroy them all! Don't let them survive. Actually, it makes much more sense to give you the leader. Yeah, I will swap these two armies. This one will be hunting down the Ottoman little stacks, and the other one is going to siege up. Hey, you think you are so clever, Ottomans, right? He even flipped. How did he supply? Oh, he merged that one dude, and he brought the the leader with him. So only from Rosetta. So if we go from Al Garbia, there is no river crossing, and this is a no. This is a desert. But this doesn't. Sh this shouldn't give us any mm, negative penalties for the battle. It's only oh look at that Naples breakthrough and Byzantium and Austria as well. This one will not be as long as the the last one, guys. Don't you worry about that. <sighs> Kill them. Squish them flat. Is something happening? Oh yes! <laughs> so Ottomans have, all in all, one regiment, one regiment of infantry somewhere. Let's kill the Oman army over here. Well, the Spain is sieging up their lands, and now we can basically just carpet siege. There's still the Persian army, of course, but it's really small, and they are so far behind. Without the Ottoman leadership, they can't really hurt us at all. Okay, I have this guy specifically for you, boys. I think actually I will split these. And start carpet sieging so they can't train any more, any more bastards over here. I think it makes sense. Especially as the sieges are really fast. I will go here and... I will wrap around like this. He's like, I can train more guys! I'm like, no! No! That's not how this works. You don't have to go there. Split the siege and continue. Mm. Go kill them. We can't let them rebuild their army. You did. Wow. Well, this is only two big. Why is it four guys? I think they are like heavily damaged or something. Like that. Nice. That's another squished army. Continue. Continue the pursuit. Hello! Dead Dia! Welcome to the stream. Kill that. Kill it. So that's that. Thingoman is ready. It's right for piecing out. He's not. And it's great that Spain is actually doing this. Like I was bad mouthing him, but he's doing a great job by doing that. He's helping a lot. Okay.
Mavis? Byzantium. And go. And I said and go. I said and go. Attack! There we go. He wasn't squished. After him! Oh, he has all this stuff as well. I love how, like, Marage is just completely cut off from anything else in the Ottoman Empire. <laughs> Empire. Empire. Can't split anyone from those. Well, this guy should be... Well, I'll teach that. Uh, wow! Wow! Fucking nobles! It's because we are noble republic, I'm pretty sure. Maybe... He, I'm not sure the, the other republics get, get that. Okay. Stability is not that expensive. This is basically paying 500 ducats for like 80 admin points. I think it's worth it. I think that's worth it. Let's pay up. There's even no like good option. Everything is just screwed. Wow, they're attacking there there? You have to be kidding me. Yeah, they are going to lose that fleet. Why is no one else helping? Well, Hansa brought their troops. Like Austria, even though they have a small fleet, one port. They have literally one port. Only girls over here. They are the ones who won us the war. By luring these fleets away from Bosporus. So we were able to squeeze through this. I forgot to hunt these down. <laughs> but it's coming in vengeance. Yes. Who are you? Most of us sieging that already. We don't have to sit there. I am from Czech Republic, and we all have the same accent. Beautiful place in the heart of Europe. Literally in the center of Europe. It's right in the middle. Okay, let's go up at siege. Let's unsiege. Can I assault it? Oh, I don't think so. We can have an extra leader, but I don't think it will keep the power projection rolling for long enough. It's so sad we can't take a Dern from them. But we are going to give all of this to Byzantium. Big guy. Because you need to be bigger! And this one as well. It's your fault that you are not fabricating claims. It's only your fault, Byzantium, that you will have to pay for these. Kosaeli. And I will take, I think, Kitiaya myself. So I will be able to fabricate claims on four provinces over here. And we just pace ourselves through the Ottomans. And now we can add Brandenburg in the, into the rotation. What are you doing up there, you bastard? What do you think you are doing? Kill it! Trebizond! It's even Greek province! How dares he! Right next to Germany, where you are from. Welcome, welcome from Germany. I actually was born like less than 100, 100 kilometers from Germany. We are going over there all the time. Look at that. The money we are making. And actually, we don't have the war taxes, so all of this comes down to this idea we took. The, the finalizer of the administrative ideas. It's just so good. It's just so good. Yeah, Austria, bring your stacks through. No! And he has no more fleets. But you know what happened? <laughs> Hansa was able to squeeze through before he could block, the, block him. And he is unsieging the one single province Ottomans managed to siege in this war. Nice. Like, so well done. 
It's it's just amazing. Kill it! Now the siege done. Let's go there. Let's split up. Oh, so there's like Ottomans! And I hope we, they will stop being their, like, their rival. We don't need them in these wars anymore. And they will have an open arrival spot. And I hope it will be Brandenburg. Because their relations are not really good. They are like on the verge of uh, becoming rivals. Look at that. So I think if, the, if they stop rivaling Ottomans... Hey! The Daya! Three will come aboard! The only problem is that they are not really going to help us because they are still the Emperor. But they shouldn't hate us for taking his stuff. At least I think that's how it works. It would be better if someone else was the Emperor, but this is never going to... Like those... The times when Austria wasn't the Emperor were the best times. We are just attacking everyone within the HRE. No one was safe from our wrath. Oh, you can actually siege it. Look at them, Mamelukes. Doing well. I can even attack Tunis. But this is all like super expensive because of the Berber tradition. It's just so fucking expensive. And it would be worthless without the coastline. We can't connect it to our capital. So that looks like... Like really close to being a capital siege. One of you at least. One of you. No, you know. You? No. Um hey, he can he can go there. Hell yeah. Continue the push. I haven't seen the Persian army yet. And they can swoop here. So let's start reinforcing Baghdad. Wow, that sounds very really recent. <laughs> You, there's, there's a bit of a crowd over there, so let's move out of there. We can actually push into Persia. It would be better to piece them out and make them break their alliance with Ottomans, so we don't have to deal with them the next time we are fighting them. Hey, Oman, would you like out? Would you like out of this war? How, how do you feel about this? He's like, ah, I can win this. We can pull this back. We are not defeated yet. Yeah, all these armies are worthless. Ottomans have literally nothing. They gave up. Oman has nothing as well. Oh, Oman has two guys. Even Tunis has a puny little army. I wish I had, like, I wish I, wish I didn't have Naples as a vassal. Because giving this all to Byzantium would make just so much more sense. But I did it. But when you are trying this, just don't... Don't do what I did. Just sell everything to Byzantium. That's one less vassal you have to uh, take care of. Oh, we don't need the... Do we need the access through Syria? Probably. I mean, you have to still get rid of the trade power from Genoa. Maybe we are getting some money from trade power. No, 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 we are not. Jerusalem! We have to also somehow get a claim on Syria so we can take them out. Uh, more than one war. That's how huge they are. Insane. Okay. Let's prepare for the campaign against Persia. They are... Wow, Baluchistan is winning? No, they are losing. No. Okay, I don't understand. Well, they lost one province. Maybe it's the war goal. Uh, fuck you. Increase centralization. Cardinals policy upset nobles against the fuckers. Nobles. National unrest for 10 years. <laughs> oh, I've lost the cardinal. Like, give me a break. Give me a break. I need a break. I like the Ottomans. They need a break as well. They can't catch a break, can they?
No, oh, this guy isn't doing anything. Let's go to Jerusalem. And you can go to Al Karak. We don't need that much stuff against Persia. This is enough. We need to kill their, their army. Should be the goal. Syria is like, uh, okay, guys, go through this. Oh, look at that. Tunis is over here. I have an army handy, so let's kill this. I completely forgot about this army, and it is my best leader. Oh, Oman wants out of the war. You want out of the war, Oman? Oh, yeah, I would like to get out of this war. Okay, so break the peace, well, the treaty with the Ottomans. Um, Spanish vassal. Uh, war reps, he isn't willing to give me that. And I want you to... I don't know. Nothing else. Only these two. Until you give it to me, there's nothing to talk about, Mr. Oman. Also, we should improve. Maybe relations with some guys? Yeah, like, most of them like me. Palatinate would. Yeah, he could use a hack. That's... Uh, maybe? Yeah, Eliash. We've been beating them up and it's something... We you shouldn't do. We were a big bully. And it's just... That's not nice. I will give them a hug and they will, they will feel much better. So even these should be cheaper. Still 20 I think percent. Switzerland's province war score modi cost modifier. Okay. <laughs> Ottomans are like... And let's build another army. We can do it. We can do it. Well, they have no army left. So, yeah. They want to do this. Let's get them out of the Ottomans. Let's take war reparations. And that's it. Money? Yeah, I'll take your filthy money. Get out! And now the, the Spaniards can get out and help us, for example, with Tunis. Hey, you guys, you can kill those, right? These are your cores, you should work on those. Okay, this is done, let's push in. And you can go, I don't know. Let's siege Sinai! I can create an army. I'm Mr. Autoderp. I'm Mr. Derps and Mac Autoderp, and I can, I can create an army for my nation. I was kind of expecting this to be on the coastline. Suez. Dead. No, I think I'm still going to Alexandria. No, I'm going to Fayum. Die. I can't kill him. Catch him. Don't let him escape. There we go. No. Tunis. They will feel all smack after defeating our small, tiny army. You know what? You will pay for this insolence. We should also try to figure out a way to connect our con territory to uh, Mamelukes. I think that would be smart. Play Sibir! Rivoin! Rivoin has the ideas! Hey Tunis, how do you feel about my uh, 35,000 Elite soldiers coming to smash your face in. How, how do you feel about that? Yeah, he... I know how he feels. He feels like a dumbass. Because that's what he is. Hey, dumbass! You can go to Fayum. Go see Javis capital. Oh my god, my vassals are already there. <laughs> but they are going to lose, most likely. Maybe not. I think they took... If they combine their stuff, they can do something about this. Maybe he will even pick up his, his 14 guys and do something smart with them. How long is this war going? 
I don't think it's that long, is it? Actually, it's four years already. It's pretty long. At least, at least this will enable us to peace out Persia and the other guys soon. Uh, very soon. Da -da, da -da. Don't you dare doing that. You will, you will pay for this insolence. You will pay for this! Also, you go find the Persian army and kill it. Okay. Move in, gentlemen. The heathens shall pay. <laughs> I kind of hurt them by breaking their only valid alliance. I think Hejaz will just be the Arabian country. I will be the Arabian country. I would really like to see where the Persian army is. Maybe they're unsieging this shit? Six hundred days, finally finished. Another reason to take the coastline as soon as possible. Because without doing that, you are simply screwed. We can move all these guys again and lower the maintenance to save that little bit of cash. Oh, there they are. Hello! I found him! Hey! Persia! How are you? Are you dead? Yeah, he's dead. Hunt him down and destroy him! Oh, Theodore, alright? Yeah. It feels like it will be quite similar to the Byzantine campaign, but I will think about it. <laughs> Baluchistan is coming with vengeance. <laughs> Hell yeah. I think... I don't think we need you, actually. Yeah, let's... No, oh, I'll let you through. And then we'll cancel the access from Syria. We don't need it all that much. He may be going all the way up there, so let's follow him. Also, is like, I can see where he's going. Holy shit, look at those carpet sieges. Austria is still a valid help. Did I kill that army or did I not? I did not. We have to find it. Where the hell are you? Piece of crap. Hey. Nice, well done. Okay, that, he's not there. Maybe in Mzab. The good should be enough. Hey, Persian provinces are just falling down. I still have to get rid of the trade power though. In Genoa. Holy shit. He found them. <laughs> you are dead! You are dead. Hey Persia, would you like out of this war? Yeah, he would like out of this war. So let's kick him out. Yeah, we have already enough war score for the call for peace anyway. And you will now treat this with Ottomans. He doesn't want to do that. We need a little bit more war score. Well, let's work on this. Boys! So he's not there. So I will go to this place. How to find this? Filthy little army. Okay, we can cancel the access. <coughs> no, he's attacking. Well, well, why would you do that? It makes no sense. Because it's his capital, he's, he's in. I don't give a shit mode. No. 
Let's see where he's going. He's still going this way. No, he's going to Fezan. Stupid attrition in the desert. Killing my beautiful army. <laughs> Persia. 795 days. I think I have to take those. I don't do siege this shit anymore. It'll cost me a lot of diplo though, taking that. Actually, no. no. It only says that it doesn't, but it does. Okay, I want to... Do you... I can only do this. I can't really do much returning. Also, why is this... Costing diplo? Oh, it works only for the Byzantine cause? No, it still costs 20. This is the reason for the war. I thought this would help and would lower the, the cost of this, but it doesn't. Okay, what's the cheapest? Well, these Mameluk lands down here. not connected though. Well, Ninia, that's six. Al Karak, let's remove that. Still 102. I guess we don't need Benghazi. That's six, so then we can take something else. Uh, that's way too much. I didn't even have to fabricate the claims. It's only 75 was uh, deployed, that's not that much. Okay, another four based. 4% Suez, maybe? No, it's not here. <laughs> what do I like it to be connected? Maybe this one. This one is fine. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take those. That's a hundred war score. So we have a target. It should jump way up when we peace out Persia. I will take prestige it. Blown up. His army is dead. Nice. Oh, you mean the this guy? No, he he went actually a different route. Ah! Tunis, you will pay with your blood. There you go. There's no army. What about peacing out? He doesn't want to peace out. I guess I will let my... My vassals finish some sieges over there. And then we will talk. This one is... 19. This is his capital. So this should give us enough war score for war reparations. More than enough! It's only Persia and Tunis. Awesome. So, you know what? Let's cancel this. I know he will be pissed off. But he will get over this. He'll give me the trade power anyway next time. Let's save that Diplo. Which you be doing the whole time. Okay, Persia. Let's get you out. It's only 11%. I just don't want to fight you the next time. War rep. He doesn't want to give me war rep. I don't understand this, like, the, the AI must see that they are defeated. It's just incapable of comprehending this. And I think I have to declare for these cars. I was kind of suspicious because it's, it's said for full annexation in the peace deal. Okay. Okay, how much money do I actually have? Nothing. Just a couple more sieges. I wouldn't like your monies. Simple as that. To siege this up, I don't know. I don't care. Hey, his capital fell. Tunis! 
How about, you, how about giving me more reparations? And cancelling the alliance with Ottomans. No, not yet. Okay, my was also. Take care of this issue momentarily. Okay, another siege finished. Two of them. How do you feel about the peace deal right now? Oh yeah, he's willing to give me all I want. I don't want him to release Afghanistan. I'm so glad that country is gone. <laughs> and I don't hate, Af hate Afghanistan. I hate that they have national idea that increases the coring cost. And I'm not saying we will get here. We may, eventually, but... And if we do, we don't want that to be around. Don't give me money. Okay, get out. Get out of my face! Persia. So it's 89%. I think we can actually like peace out right now. Just need a diplomat back. Military spending. Eh, I don't care. No sieges coming up. Okay. We just have to keep our armies in the in the enemy territory. Doesn't make much difference. White piece. You are welcome, Baluchistan. You are welcome. Actually, you can go all the way home. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think it's time to end this episode. We have beaten the Ottomans. It took just an episode and a half. And then we are going for France again, I think. Yep, no more... No more bullshit over here. They are still allied with Papal State, Liège, Netherlands and Lenape. But... Oh my god. No, don't tell me that this happened. No, he's defending. King Christoph Marienburg. Wow. Why would you even do that, Brandenburg? It makes no sense. Anyway, have a nice day and bye-bye.